Yeah, Liam, it's been a bit of a journey. I think it was round three when he did that injury, but uh, he's done all, all the right things, rehabilitated well, got himself up to really good level of fitness and trained, trained the house down uh, last Saturday and, uh, and through this week, so uh, he's available for selection. Yeah, so Chris has had a really good build-up, um, got through his uh, hamstring protocol testing on, on Saturday, trained well this week, and he's available to play. The bike came at a really good time for Luke. Um, he got another solid block of training over that period and he's now available to play. A young Hamish, uh, it's been a long time out of, the, out of uh, footy, unfortunately, uh, for Hamish, but uh, he's done a good job in getting himself back to this position where um, if we can get through the last bit of training this week, um, hopefully he'll make his debut uh, at East Perth on the weekend. Yeah, Eric's had a really big period, um, uh, both in the gym and on the track. Done everything right, um, and we think we're nearly there. Um, just got our fingers crossed for this last uh, last training session prior to uh, the game on the weekend, and assuming all goes well with that, he'll, uh, he'll make his debut for the season. Tony's pulled up quite well. Um, from uh, having a break over the over the uh, bye period. He's trained pretty well this week. Um, it's been fairly light, but um, trained well yesterday and uh, expect him to play for East Perth on the weekend. Yeah, Will's had a similar training uh, regime and rehabilitation phase to Chris Marston and he's uh, tracked in the same way, very positively, got through a big session last Saturday and has trained well this week uh, and uh, should be available to be selected on the weekend. Yeah, as we mentioned last week with Dan Venables, he's turned the corner. Um, he had a really sharp session uh, yesterday uh, with the main group uh, down at Optus and uh, looking better and better. Um, we're hopeful now that it's only uh, imminent that he'll play in the next two weeks.